Hey everybody, and welcome back to an all new episode of Living with Dustin. This one's a little special. This one is featuring Growing Together and Hey Harry Coastal Collection Part 1. So, as you can see here, we have this is Hey Harry's website. I am going to link Hey Harry's website down in the description down below. Um, I believe this might be on Cursed Forge, but don't hold me to that. I'll look. And if it is, I'll put it in the description. So this came out in February of 23 this year. Here's just, I saw this picture and I saw these doors and I was like, shit girl. So here's a little, you know, like drive through or whatever you want to call preview of the windows that come in this collection. The shutters are separate. Amazing. Um, these doors are just the garage doors. And we need garage doors in the game, even if they're not functional. So, um... But yeah, it came with 22 doors, Georgian Craftsman and Cottage Styles. Go with everything, really. 24 doors, front doors, cottage doors, French doors, interior doors, and archways. Love the archways. You'll see them at the tour. Um, and I'm trying something a little different today with the tour, so we'll see. Anyway, six shutters, three heights, left and right options, three window boxes, one, two, and three tiles wide. This is available now. I believe it's up to six. Let me look. Part six, yes, which I believe is a bathroom part, which just look at this. Look at this CC, y'all. Look. Look. So anyway, I love this tile too. So I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to get this. I'm thinking I wanna wait until she's done with the collection and then do a build or a remodel of like a house in um, Brindleton Bay and use nothing but the Coastal Collection. Okay, so let's get on into the speed build, shall we? Okay, you guys, so this one was a fun one. Um, this house originally, sadly, was slated to be the home of my generation's family growing up summers and it was going to be our growing together let's play and it was going to be something that we um continued to work on you know or work on that we lived in for years to come but i remembered how much i don't really like building or living in two-story houses but you guys it breaks my heart because i love this house we're going to do a tour at the end um i'm going to do the tour kind of like a because I'm going to try to start uploading to TikTok. I hate TikTok, I'm not going to lie. Um, but I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. What can I say? So, um, but I want to do a, um, I want to do a, what's it called? Uh, I want to do a, um, like a tour, like a walkthrough tour, like a real estate agent. I think that would be fun. Um, so there's that. I'm going to do that, I think. And then we'll see how that goes. If it's stupid, then we won't do it anymore. Um, I even have it down. I haven't downloaded it yet, so I need to do it cheap. I have to download the damn sign. A friend of mine, um, Pug Owns, and gave me the name of a friend of theirs who made a sign. And I'm sorry, I am so bad with names. I will have it before I do the tour, and I will put it in the description if I'm allowed to. I don't know if I'm allowed to. I'll find out. If I'm not, I don't know. Maybe we'll skip the sign for now. I don't know, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. I don't know. So, anyway, so yeah, and then here I decided that I needed to have a um, diagonal bit, which I hate building on diagonals, and I hate curved walls, and I don't see that changing anytime soon, because they both are kind of wonky, especially the curved walls. I thought they fixed them. This railing that I did right here, I love it. I love this porch. I really do love this house and I really want to use it. Now, as you may have seen a second ago, we're not using the Hey Harry collection at first because I um, don't think I actually knew about it yet. So, um, I knew about it yet. So, I couldn't use it because I didn't know about it. So, you guys, I just realized something. Jesus, June, I work in this chair too. Look you guys, I'm in the circle. Um, okay. Now I might be a bit too high, but that's okay. Oh my god, have you guys heard this new song? 
And if I think about it, I will put it up in a picture of it on the screen right now. It's by Bebe Rexa and Dolly Parton. It's called Seasons. It is so good. The seasons change right under my feet. I'm still the same, 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 same old me. <laughs> this house took me forever, you guys. And then when I decided that I didn't want a two story house, I was like <laughs> heartbroken. I have been in therapy and I've been taking it out of my Sims that I've been sad. So that's changing, girl. I just uploaded, if you haven't gone and watched it yet, I just uploaded, um, I just uploaded, um, a, um, 100 baby challenge episode you guys i love what i did with the pool here and it is all functional i tested it so if it doesn't work when you download it because this is on the gallery um i don't know what to tell you because it worked when i i i player i player test everything and it works when i upload it i can't tell you what the sims does so i always recommend bb dot move objects viatches when you're placing my builds all of them um like literally like more so than not it has bb.move objects on in it so um let's talk about twitter um this railing oh my god you guys you, look at this porch i aspire to have a porch like this in real life i would live in if i won a lottery i would build this house seriously i would build this house right here to a T. This is maybe this is my dream. This is my dream house. Yeah, yeah. This could be my dream house. It really could. So you guys, horse ranch. Oh no, let's talk about this stupid X shit on Twitter. It's always gonna be Twitter. I hate this shit. I'm over it so bad. Um, let's just not talk about it. Um, so I used um, the only real CC that I used. I used some CC. I won't lie in this build, but the main CC you'll need is the Hey Harry Coastal Collection Part 1, um, which is the windows and doors. The rest is just a few furniture items. I use max 20 counters. We'll see that in the kitchen in a minute. Um, but the rest is just the game and a lot of growing together. And that's mostly for like the decor on the inside of the house. So really you are going to want to want Hey Harry Collection Part 1, um, max 20... If I remember, I'll link them down below. Let's see if I can bring them. Let's see if I can bring them up. Sometimes I remember to bookmark stuff, and other times I don't. And then other times I don't know how to get to my bookmarks. Okay, you guys, I skipped back a little bit, and I hope I didn't skip back too far, but I kind of zoomed out there for a second. Um, I'll have to leave that in editing. But um, Max 20 has a kitchen set, and I'm trying to look for the name of it right now. Give me a second. Oh, I need to download these. I should download those. Oh, anyway, um, I don't know the set. If I remember it, I'll link it in, in the description. But it's, um, what is it called? It's the kitchen appliances, or counters. Counters, God bless America, the kitchen cabinets. And I love it. These doors, though, you guys, these garage doors. Oh. So, you notice right here, we're building a new crest. This house right here is why I decided that I will never pre build for a pack until we know the orientation and lot sizes. And I will tell you why. I built this house when they said that we were getting a 50 by 40 here, and then it was the opposite direction. It was, it was, it was 40 by 50 this way instead of this way and it was just like I was so pissed so here's the max 20 counters um I love this tile I believe that's max 22 um I love this kitchen I thought it was really cool laid out I jump around a lot you guys and I've also decided oh you know there it was um I forgot I need to start with like if I do it you know I need to write it down and then that way I, I need to be a better organized with my CV builds. But what I was going to say is this may jump around because I just started cutting stuff out because there was a lot of footage on this. And I didn't want this thing to be like 
ridiculously long. Yeah. So here we are. Um, but it's um, max 20. I wish I could see it. But it pops up. And the appliances go with it. It's like a whole CC pack. So you're fine. Like some of the appliances I use go with it. And here I thought I was going to go uh, the dark with it. But I changed my mind. Because that's all I do apparently is black and white. Oh my god, you guys, this is the living room. I love this lounge. I really want to live in this house. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know who we could use this house for. I wonder. We can't afford it though in my, uh, my, um, what I was going to say is my, we can't afford it in my horse ranch LP. So I was going to say, what if we turned it into a horse ranch? That could work. We could turn it into a horse but we can't afford it. Like I just said, we can't afford it. So I love this living room. I can't wait for you guys to see this in person. Um, the living room and the kitchen and the dining room, I had a lot of fun with. I was so indecisive. You guys, I am, when I'm building, when I'm building a house for a specific family, it takes me forever to build because I can't decide what I want to build. I love this table and chairs combo. Oh, gorgeous. And I love this line. I love this fireplace. I love these little knick-knacky things right here that came with growing together, like these little statuary things, whatever you want to call them. Um, that fireplace is gorgeous. I believe that came with growing together. Oh, that picture above the TV is from, I believe, Hey Harry 2. And it's a TV, but when it's off, it looks like a painting. Love it. I love this house, you guys. I am so disappointed in myself for not using it. So, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know what to do. I love this house so much, it's so pretty. And it turned out so good. Like, it is literally, I'm pretty sure this is my dream house. I mean, I don't know how, I, I don't even know what else to tell you. I'm pretty sure it is my dream house. You know what I mean? So, what was I gonna say? So there's a laundry room on, down here, there's a garage, there's a... Is there a greenhouse in the final version? I can't remember. Oh, this room right here. So originally this room right here, I built this room to be like a guest room slash... Um, my son Dustin was going to record a cooking show, so he was going to do like... Some of his interviewing of his celebrity friends here. And... um. I ended up moving, so. <laughs> the new house is really cute, though. It's a lot smaller. It's a one-story. It is mid-century modern. And, um... It has a lot of growing together in the same counters by Max 20. And, um, a lot... Of, I haven't used some of the wallpapers in here, I don't think. I used the growing together ones, but I may change it. But the new house, wait till you see the living room on it. The house is good too. I'm a slow builder, but I feel like my builds are good. You know what I mean? And they're functional and like all the sides are done. And um, it doesn't take your Sims six years to walk everywhere. And um, you know, a couple other things. So there's that. So, um, I'm gonna tell you one thing. I mean, let's be honest. Look at that rug. CC cre I love that rug. CC creators get a lot of shit, right? But plants, plants. You guys, I don't know. I hope I'm not lagging or anything. My computer usage, which it's not even very high, but it is, it is high for me. Anyway, um, so I'm gonna get rid of the web page. Maybe that'll help. So yeah, so here we are, we start working on the garage. The garage is supposed to be where Dustin and um, Adeline, his daughter, grow nectar and, or grow things and they make juice fizz, which might convert to nectar now that nectar is actually in the game. Um, Cause I got an idea for that, for my storyline. But um, they have it in their new house too. But yeah, and then I put this little art corner in the garage and some tools and the bikes. Ugh. I love this upstairs hallway. I really can't wait for you guys to see this in person. Um, I had some clipping of the door there because I have a platform, so I just cut out the floor. 
And I made it a mezzanine level, because why not? This bathroom, oh, I love the way this bathroom turned out too. So like, on one side of the T is the toilet, and on the other side is the shower. With the sink, and then there's lights around the edges. It's so cute. See the lights right there? I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. I would love, and I know other people probably would not say this, so um, it's probably a me thing. I would love more toilets and sinks and stuff with the same kind of style that the sinks and stuff from and tile from Growing Together came in. I would love it. I would love it. I just love that style. I think it's better than a lot of the styles that we have been getting. And I think it goes with a lot of stuff. Like I think you can do with like craftsman, you can do like modern, you can do mid-century with it. Um, this is Adeline's supposed to be room. She's a young adult, but I wanted her to still have like a young fun side. But she's also kind of like dark and moody and artsy. So I gave her this room, but she won't get it. <laughs> but I don't know, the next speed build might be the new house that I built for this. And like I said, I'm going to try to start the LP soon. So I got a few things left to do. I'm getting back to it. I just, this, if this gets posted the week of August 1st, it will be two videos in one week, biatches. So I can do it. I can do it. It just takes effort. Yum, yum, Pepsi. I hope you couldn't hear me drink that. So this is Colton Allen's room. He is the youngest remaining Summers family member. His room is space themed because he's interested in things strange and out there and aliens and Strangerville and all that business. and. I almost called them Autobots, not Autobots, but the um, Void Critters, he's into those. Um, he likes video games. Yeah, so I think he might also get into some acting, but I haven't quite decided yet because his dad was in a sci-fi movie a long time ago before he was born, and he really just took to that movie, and so he's just, sorry, I thought my cats were killing themselves and each other. Um, so, but yeah, so then this room over here is Bradford Dale. He is the second oldest. Um, he's at a lot, him and, um, Colt and Alan have the same dad who stole from me. So I broke up with him and divorced him. My son himself did. This family is getting ready to come back to the channel. I look really pale today. I need to go tan. I don't leave the house. So, you know, like no sun. I at least need to tan my hands and my face so you guys think I go outside. Anyway, so, um, this family's got some goss. I mean, when they weren't on YouTube, Dustin did some shoot when he was a kid. So, this is Bradford Dale's room. He's, he's into, um, he's into, um, sports and, um, he likes a little bit of video games as well. And he also, like, deep down likes animals, but they don't really have animals because they move around a lot. So, um, oh, hi, Grimmy. This is my little black cat, Grimothy. He is named after the Grim Reaper in The Sims 4. Well, all The Sims games, but, um, he's a Brad. We do, Grimmy. So, um, but yeah, this is Brad for Dale's room. Those chairs right there, they're from, um, Growing Together, I believe. Yes. Yeah, they're from Growing Together. But, oh my god, this master bedroom, this whole master suite, that's what I was going to tell y'all, is in the diagonal. It has a huge walk-in closet. Um, it has a huge walk-in closet. And, um, it's black and white and gray. It's just so pretty. I, this is really, it really is my dream, it really is my dream house. I won't lie. So, but we're almost done the speed of it. But I forgot what I was going to say a second ago. I got distracted. I got distracted. Yeah, we are literally almost done with the speed build, so then we're gonna hop into game and go on a tour. <laughs> a <t> no, <laughs> don't pause on that face, please don't. I'm already ugly enough as it is. Don't pause on that face. Don't do it. Don't. Um, so, 
Yeah, mostly the house itself though is base game. The wallpapers and stuff on the inside are CC and um, grown, to, grown, grown together, growing together. So I'm gonna open up the game. I'll be right back and we're going to go on tour. You guys, Dustin here with, with Land Grab Realty and look at this beauty. This is a eucalyptus lane here in San Sequoia. Oh, we got us a beautiful double rainbow today, don't we, folks? Okay, so this baby just hit the market. So you come over here. We're going to walk down here and go through the gate. Um, you've got a gorgeous fountain here in the, um, you know, the, I can't think of what this thing's called, the motor, um, cape, motor cage area. But anyway, so we're going to go around through here. Oh my gosh, look at this gorgeous landscaping. Oh my gosh, this house is just gorgeous. Anyway, so you come up the steps here. Oh, let's hold on. We gotta work my key. Okay, so you come in the front door here. <laughs> so, okay, so here to our right, we have. Oh, that's too high. There we go. To our right here, we have the home office. Oh my goodness, look at this. So you walk in. Oh, now I'm not supposed to tell you this, but the homeowner here is a celebrity. So. Yeah, that's why we got some awards up here. So, you know, privacy though, I'm not supposed to tell you who it is. So anyway, so yeah, you got your home office here. You can work from home. Ugh. So you come across the main hall here. Um, straight ahead, you have a half bath. Let's take a look in here. Oh my God, look at these gorgeous finishes, you guys. Oh, that's the homeowner. Ugh. Very quiet, very hush hush. So anyway, over here you have the guest suite. Uh, see, the homeowner uses this to record a cooking show. He does the interviews in here, and then they cook in this kitchen. Wait till you see this kitchen. So anyway, we've got this is the guest bedroom. This is a Murphy bed that comes down out of the wall. Mm -hmm. So you come over here. Oh, look at these views of San Sequoia. I'm telling you, the harbor. Mm. So anyway, you come into here, and this is a full bath with a shower. No tub, unfortunately, but we're in that diagonal part of the house, so there's not that much room, and they really use it on the guest suite here. So anyway, you come back out to the main foyer. I thought that door was a secret door at first. How funny. So anyway, so you come across here. Oh, you guys, look at this. Look at this great room. Isn't this just gorgeous look at this double height ceilings original wayne's cotting this remodel is amazing look at this bar area oh you could do some deals here i tell you what then you have this dining area now originally the dining room was bigger but the homeowner when they bought the house remodeled and added a screen and porch and i think it really adds up to the house so look at this folks here's that eating kitchen so anyway you have um two double dishwasher drawers chef's um refrigerator double ovens gas range vent hood look at all this storage oh this is gorgeous that's the home office back there okay you come out here you have your back door which takes you back out front this is your laundry oh look at this laundry look at this tile it's been re um glazed all the tiles been reglazed here's the garage gorgeous huge garage yes yes honey okay that takes you out back but we'll go out there in a minute okay let's step out here real quick onto this screened in porch oh this is amazing this is gonna be great in the summertime like you get a nice view of the yard oh oh my goodness oh my goodness let's go back inside we're gonna go over here and we're gonna we're gonna um we're gonna head upstairs. Um, so you come up to the top of the stairs here, and then you have, um, oops, I slipped on the step there. You got your landing here with your view down to the front door. Oh my God, look at the views of the harbor. Look at this, this is just gorgeous. Oh, so, okay, no, we'll save this for last. This is the master, so this is the first. This is the second small, second largest bedroom on this floor, second largest bedroom has a no walk-in closet unfortunately but it does have an ensuite Ugh, gorgeous ensuite all new all new fixtures but they're made to look old so you come back over here we have a hall Ooh, oh, i slipped again and hit the shower we have a hall bath again all new fixtures come over here oh look here's that great room again and that tv that painting's a tv 
anyway, oh, look at the views out the window. Just I just can't get over the views. So you come in here. This is the smallest of the rooms. No ensuite, no walk-in closet, but it's a good sized room. Some great views from here. Oh, gorgeous, gorgeous. Then you come over here. This is the last of the bedrooms. This is the third largest. No ensuite, but it shares the hall bathroom. Oh, look at the views. Great size yard, great size yard. Okay, so I am going to meet you guys downstairs. Ah, okay, so you can back out these doors out the back here and look at this. Ah, you have your conversation pit. You have your barbecue and your grill. Oh, this is just, oh, this is just gorgeous. And look at this pool. Matt, oh, watch your head. Imagine the lounging you could do out here. Oh, it's just, oh, it's just gorgeous, just gorgeous. If you come around this way, oh, that would be perfect for a treehouse. We have an on sit here. Ugh, it's just gorgeous, just gorgeous. Look at this, this house, uh, it is just gorgeous. This lot is huge. But anyway, you guys, this just hit the market. Thank you so much for watching this. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the build. Um, it is up on the gallery now if you want to buy. Um, just let me know and I'll have my people call your people. We can make a deal. But anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. Um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Make sure to ding the bell so you get notifications when I post new videos. And um, I will see you guys next time. Love you, mean it. Bye.